Tony Brown. The increasing number of blacks at the nation's major universities may be black, but there are also black people who are increasingly immigrants from Africa, the West Indies, and Latin America. The largest minority in America is already Hispanic, and based on the trends, the future leadership of black America itself will be foreign born. African Americans are now at the end of the diversity line, a new study finds. My guest on this program is Dr. Camille Charles, Associate Professor of Sociology at the University of Pennsylvania and co-author of a study on black immigrant enrollment at major colleges. Welcome, Doctor. Thank you. Thank you for being with us. We're going to use some words I know the public has heard a lot about, but you and higher education uh, have varying definitions of it. So I want to start with this concept diversity, first of all. Okay. And I want to start with uh, when we get to the findings of your study so they'll have some context for it in, a, in, a, in the insider higher education way. So the idea is to get a representative number right. of African Americans right. on that track. Exactly. And I think what's happened with the term diversity is that as there was a lot of backlash against affirmative action, we just started changing the terminology. So, so that in fact, for quite a long time when we said we wanted to diversify our campuses, that was sort of a more acceptable way to talk about increasing the numbers of American minorities on those campuses. So we talked about multiculturalism and we talked about diversity. And affirmative action or the uh, compensation to the African American community for the hundreds of years of what has happened to them, quite frankly, got put on the black back burner. Yes and no. I think I'm, I do think there were sort of two things going on, and and so on the one hand, you had um, the the Michigan affirmative action case and the the um, Supreme Court ruling around that, and so what you had was. Um, institutions scrambling around trying to maintain their affirmative action programs while uh, following the letter of the law as well so that you have this shift in language and you have institutional representatives really talking about the importance of diversity as part of the educational experience.